right to work or not? That's now a question in the Arizona legislature. I was, you know, teaching and working for 50 to 60 hours a week for less than $30,000 and very few benefits. It's this experience that made State Representative Oscar De Los Santos co-sponsor a new bill with two other Democrat lawmakers that would repeal the current right-to-work law in Arizona. Though laws are constantly changing, Arizona is currently one of about half the states in the U.S. that are right to work, meaning there is not a requirement to join a union to get or keep a job. De Los Santos says having unions would be better for Arizona workers. When you're unable to band together with your colleagues and co-workers to negotiate a fair contract, your wages go down, you have worse benefits, uh, less likely to get health insurance, you're less likely to get a pension. But there are two sides to this that employment attorney Joshua Black sees from an outside perspective. Research shows that states that are right to work states tend to have better employment numbers, meaning generally that does attract businesses. Uh, however, again, to criticize that, those employees generally are paid less and receive less benefits. Black says there are truly pros and cons. I think it gets people talking because it, it's somewhat of a political issue. Black says people would have to take into account if the support of a union is worth the price. It's like having a watchdog overseeing what's happening in the workplace. People always grumble a little bit about deductions from their paycheck, and rightfully so. Every dollar that comes out is a dollar that doesn't go home. De Los Santos says he and his colleagues hope to reach across the aisle to their Republican counterparts with the belief this would benefit Arizonans working in all sorts of industries. It is an attempt to rebuild the middle class and respect the dignity of work. Now, this bill was just introduced, so it has a long way to go before it could even make it to the governor's desk, and it's very possible it could die before it got there. But Black says no matter what, it's good to have these conversations and look at our rules every so often to see if it's still the best option for Arizona workers. Live in the newsroom tonight, Brianna Whitney for Arizona's Family.